Alright, Yeah. Alright, cool, cool, cool. Back up on my shit, okay then. Okay, okay. I got all this blood on my hand. A lot of niggas slime, but ain't this. Little nigga, but I move big. This here is super packing. You know what the fuck going on, man? Keep slime first, slime, Ross Ross, and all that. And I'm here with a very special guest. Take notes. And we're here to talk about the experience August 8th at the Pinhook during North Carolina. But before we get into all that, Introduce yourself, let them know where you can find you at and all that good shit. Oh, what's up, everyone? I'm Take Notes with a Z. You know what I mean? You can find me on Instagram at underscore Take Notes underscore. Um, yeah, I'm like bad, bad. music songwriter. Cool. So, uh, first question I got to ask, and I've been waiting to ask this, is where did you get your name from? What made you come <laughs> with the name Take Notes? Because I told somebody else about your name, and they were like, Oh, she must be dope because take notes is a bold statement. So what made, what made you feel like that should be on there? Oh my goodness. So I went through three three stages of names. Okay. Um, my first name was Shea Stone. Okay. That was like the first artist name I had. Okay. Um, then I graduated from Shea Stone to like Buddha. Mm -hmm. Buddha was like the spiritual side of me. Mm -hmm. Shea Stone was like the beginning of my art. Um, and then during my spiritual connection and reconnecting with myself, I started to write about a lot of deeper things. Mm -hmm. I realized my pen game was becoming like, okay. you know, yeah, yeah, yeah. So I was like, oh, we got to step it up a bit. Okay, okay. So now we take notes. That's dope, that's dope. So what, what inspires the music? I know for people that haven't heard your music, your music is very like neo-soulish, r and ish yeah. what, what inspires you to even go that route with you saying like you really started off with the writing is more so like the foundation of it. What decided, what made you go into that side of music? Instead of like just rapping or some shit. Or um, poetry or something like that, you know? I don't know, I, I kind of just go with the flow. Okay. I think just like spiritually that's just where the line where that's just will happen. Okay. Yeah, that's yeah dope. for sure. That's dope. So as a as a music artist, as a local music artist, um what what is some of your goals like that you're looking for this year? We're getting towards the end of the year. What are some things you're looking to accomplish? Or even going into next year, what are some things you're looking to accomplish? Oh, what a great question. And the door has the letter C for consistency. Because go. that's all I'm focused on this Best. year and any year. It's just remaining consistent with whatever goals I put down. Um, a few goals will be to perform at some festivals. Okay. To get into doing more shows. Mm -hmm. um, to write for Ari Lennox. Okay. Goal. Okay. Yeah, for sure. So, but most importantly, just staying consistent. Okay. Like that. I know that's right. I know yeah. that's right. So, um, what can people expect from this live performance that that we got coming up in a few days? What can people expect from your set, from your energy, what you bring to the stage? Oh my goodness. Well, I'll I'll be performing with a live band. Okay. Um, so I'll have a bass player, a guitar player, a keyboards player, a violinist, oh, a drummer. Nice. Um, so you'll be expecting some frequencies okay. from, you know, the instruments. Mm -hmm. And then, you know, the rest, you just gotta, you you gotta, gotta take notes. Oh, you gotta take notes. There you go. <laughs> <laughs> yo, yo, I know you, uh, you mentioned Ari Lennox, so before, before I let you leave, I want to ask you what, what, who else are some of your inspirations? Oh, man. Because I love Ari, too. Uh, Cleo Soul, okay. Jamila Woods, okay. Marion Mariba, okay. just name a few. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, okay. no, that's a good selection. That's yeah. a good selection. Smino. Yeah. You see this? Just I'm know. Waiting. <laughs> <laughs> just know. I know. I know. Well, you can catch us both August 8th at the Experience Journal North Carolina. Let them know where they can follow you at and they can find you online and find your music. Yeah, once again, you guys can follow me um, on Instagram, TikTok, all other social media platforms at underscore take notes with a Z underscore. And then you can find my music on all distribution platforms. Facts, facts. We appreciate y'all. One love. One love.